my weak little arms can't carry out this box. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Do you notice anything different? Oh, look at my bookshelves! I honestly... I can't even describe how happy they make me. I just keep sitting in my room looking at them because they're so pretty. But I will be doing a bookshelf tour very soon, so keep your eye open. Just your one eye. Keep your eye open for it. Uh, but today I have a very exciting video. Upon achieving these bookshelves, I needed to buy more books. Well, I didn't need to, but I wanted to, so... We're doing a book haul. Um, I have quite a few books, quite a few of them are part of the series, so there's that. Okay, so the first book that I got is a book that I've wanted for the longest time, and as soon as it came, I read it because I was too impatient, and that is Truly Devious by Maureen Johnson. This book, oh my god, just wait until I do my May wrap up because this book made me feel something but if you do not know what this book is and you have been living under a rock because I swear to god it's one of the most hyped up books and I can see the hype on booktube but this book is about a murder which happened in 1936 at the Ellingham Academy. Ellingham Academy is a private school for basically gifted and talented students so if they have a love for a certain thing for example there are inventors artists authors personality youtube personality stars and there's this one girl called stevie bell who is our main character for the book and she goes to ellingham academy to try and solve the cold case of the Ellingham murders. So in 1936, Albert Ellingham, who is the creator and founder of the school, his wife and daughter get kidnapped. And the only thing that he gets left with is a riddle with a list of methods of murder. And so the book is two points of view, so it's from Stevie's in present day and then Albert Ellingham's point of view in 1936. There's also these really cool bits in this book where there's, there's like uh, where the detective is asking members of the household um, what they thought happened and I really like these parts of the book, I find it really interesting and yeah if you're in if you're looking for a new try try if you're looking for a new true crime series then I highly recommend the truly devious books so I have the first book and then I also got the vanishing stair which is the second book and hand on the wall the next book that I have is the hazelwood by Melissa Albert this book is very intriguing i don't know much about it but what i do know is that alice is the main character of this book and her grandmother is a author of some dark fairy tales which have a cult following and when her grandmother dies her mother gets kidnapped oh my god a massive rainstorm is happening outside her, when her grandmother dies her mother gets kidnapped and she needs to go on to the estate where her grandmother lived which was the hazelwood and she was always forbidden to visit because her mother didn't like her visiting she said it was very strange and she has to go to the hazelwood where she finds that her mother was kidnapped by some of the creatures that were in the books i'm not too sure i can't remember exactly what this is about but nonetheless i'm very excited for this and it sounds very dark and exciting and i think i'm going to save it for a dark and gloomy day next up we have a book that again has been very hyped up on booktube and if i don't enjoy it i'm going to be severely disappointed in myself because so many people have loved it and i feel like it's right up my alleyway and it is six of crows by lee bardugo i know i did say the name wrong in the last video that i did uh <laughs> we're not going to talk about my pronunciation of authors in that one video because 
as I, as I was editing it I was like no you said it wrong uh anyway on to this book again I'm not too sure what this book is about I know it's about a gang and they team up there's six of them and they go and do a heist on something I can't really remember the details of this book but I am very 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 excited to read it that people have said that there's a lot of great friendships in this book which I'm all for I'm all for good friendships because I don't have many friends and I like to find friends in books how sad does that make me and lastly we have a series which I've wanted to read for a long time and now there is a series coming out on Disney Plus and if you don't know what it is and if you've been living under a rock it is Percy Jackson I don't know why I've never read these books because I feel like they'd be right up my alley especially when I was younger because oh, I am just very excited don't really know much about it which I probably makes me like the only person in the world who doesn't know about Percy Jackson but I know it's got mythology and it's got fighting in it and I don't know I'm very excited my whole Twitter was just exploding the other day when Rick Riordan announced that there was a Disney Plus special coming out and I was like right it's time to read Percy Jackson then uh, so yeah I have all five books I think it is yes Percy Jackson and the Lightning Thief Percy Jackson and the Sea of Monsters Percy Jackson and the Titan's Curse Percy Jackson and the Battle of the Labyrinth and lastly Percy Jackson and the Last Olympian I am very very excited to be reading these books and to show my excitement I'm going to be doing a series on my channel where I'll be reading one book per video and yeah I think in, I'm thinking of starting it today as of filming uh, so there should be a video the first video of me reading Percy Jackson The Lightning Thief coming very soon because I literally can't wait any longer to read them I wanted to wait to film this video and then I'm going to start reading them because I'm just so excited literally I can't wait to feel 12 years old because that is the audience that these books are based at so yeah <laughs> So that is the end of my book haul. I hope you have all enjoyed this. If you have, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up and there will be a bookshelf tour coming very... I just not Tina down. There will be a bookshelf tour coming very soon and I'm very excited to show you because it is literally my pride and joy. Uh, I will see you all very soon with another video. Bye!